What up, good people? Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. You know, sometimes people play, and you don't know if people are serious or not in the times that we are right now. Last night during my live stream, here's the thing with, with, with me and um, my channel. You know, I'm 57 years old. I'm, I'm up there in age. And the demographics for my channel are people that are similar to me, you know. We've got a lot of people that are in their 40s, their 50s, their 60s, and so on. And so, you know, we've got less road in front of us than we got behind us. And I always try and live my life like every day is my last. In fact, I end up saying it at the end of the, the night when I do my fireside chat. That you should tell the people you love. Don't, don't leave any doubt. Always let people know how you feel about them because you might not get the chance to get One of these times, I'm going to be doing that fireside chat. And I'm going to say I love you guys. And it will be the last time that I ever am able to say that and I don't want to leave doubt so last night we're doing our live stream and it's like family you know I've got so many people there that are you know that, that, that I I never met but I feel like they're family and stuff because of YouTube and it's a great thing about it so last night we had a person Mr. Mom comes through and if you know, and at first glance it was like what are you talking about he said the weed guy died now we've got a guy named I Love Weed. Okay, okay. You, you know, he's been there for a long time and he's like, you know, family. You know, whenever I see I Love Weed, I always say, Pass the Dutchie from the left. You know, because with a name like I Love Weed, you got to figure he's passing the Dutchie from the left, maybe from the right too, and, and even in the middle. I don't know. But he had said he had died. And strangely, he was not on the chat last night, so this got me worried. I sent an email to him, you know, during the show because I was like, is this person real or not? But it's, the guy's name was Mr. Mom. And we looked back through and we said, dude, can you expand on what you're talking about? You know, what, what, what are you talking about? Are you talking about I love weed? Are you talking about somebody else? I, what are you talking about? And they disappeared. And so we kind of thought it was a troll because the comment before that was, after the Cowboys lost to Green Bay, he shot his PlayStation. And so it's like, how do you go from shooting your PlayStation to, you know, telling us that I love weed died? So I sent the email, finished the live stream, checked my email, nothing. Woke up this morning in the middle of the night, going to the bathroom, checked my email, nothing. And then I started really getting worried. Did my fireside, did my morning video, checked my email, nothing. And now I'm like, okay, I, I don't know what else to do here. And uh, fortunately, I just saw, um, he, I love weed for everybody's wondering, just emailed me and said, you know, he was at fan, friends or family's house last night and this, that, and the other, and couldn't be on the live stream and things. And then he sees that, you know, that, that he died, you know? So thank goodness, I love weed is okay. So I don't know what that person was doing. If you think that it was funny or a joke or something, that's not something to joke about. It honestly is not something to joke about. Um, we had somebody who, uh, we all know he's annoying. Okay. Philadelphia, but he's cool people. Philadelphia always comes on the chat. You know what you're going to get with them. He's going to tell you that the Cowboys ain't seen a, a Super Bowl since, uh, you know, on, on a VCR. You know, he's going to troll you and all that. But he, too, is like family. And when somebody had said he had died and we hadn't seen him for, you know, a couple of days, you know, we got worried about him because even though he's a fan of another team, you're still part of the family. So, yeah, I'm, I'm happy that I Love Weed is okay. All right, good people. It's um, Saturday, and for me, you know, game day starts early. Um, I've got to go get some, uh, get, get about ten pounds of hamburger, and I got to get cheese uh, for the uh, 
the big sub. I got to get the big sub. We didn't have that last week and we lost. I'm trying to do everything I can. Got to make a big pot of chili to go with it and stuff. So, uh, and get my turkey for Thanksgiving. Got to do that too. And I got to pick up uh, stuff, some spices for my mom. You know, some nutmeg and cinnamon and sugar and flour and all that stuff. And fruitcake mix because it's getting to be that time. And <laughs> mom's making them pies. Oh, she's making them pies and them cookies. And yeah, I'm going to get back. After the football season, we'll get back to keto. All right, good people. I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace.